Previously, we created already a video on rotating needles on a PowerPoint dashboard, where we can change the rotation of a needle based on a database value in real time. In this video, we are going to change the length or the width of any PowerPoint shape dynamically. We start with this nice looking presentation and we are going to animate this shape here. And basically we are going to change the width of this shape dynamically based on a database value. So first of all, we have to set up a link to a database. And for this example, we are going to use Excel. So we are opening the list of connections, select the Microsoft Excel data provider, and we browse to the file that we want to use. After that, we add a query to the Excel file where we use a sheet, a data range. We set that the first row contains the field names and we lower the refresh rate to every second. So now we are going to change or set the shape to its maximum value. Like so. And we go into data point, meter, linking to the data connection that we have, team A as a column, we are going to change the width the maximum value is set to 500 and we click the button that this is the maximum value. That's it. Now we have the value 280 from the database or the Excel file on this scale. Now we can run the slideshow, open the Excel file, make some changes to the Excel file and save the Excel file. Data point will pick up the changes and it will update the meter in real time. So here we see the value changing from 280 to 180. Use DataPoint to display real-time dashboards in PowerPoint.